everyone, welcome to Korea Eat Happy. This is Ochkeron. Today I wanted to show you how to make pickled daikon radish amazuzuke. Sweet and sour daikon radish. You can of course use white daikon, but if you have red one, it turns pink and it's pretty. It's a perfect side for any kind of meal. You can use it as hashiyasume if you know. It's like having a different flavor while having dishes. I hope you find this recipe helpful and I hope you can try it out. Here are the ingredients. Wash and cut daikon with skin is okay into half slices. Of course, quarter slices are okay. Wrap with salt and leave for 20 minutes. Meanwhile, put the seasonings in a microwavable container and bring to a boil in a microwave. Yes, you can put in a saucepan and bring to a boil as well. Wipe and clean dirt from kombu kelp. After 20 minutes, rinse daikon radish slices and drain well. Put all the ingredients in a ziplock bag and keep in the fridge overnight or more. And now it's done! You can keep it in the fridge for a week or so. Thanks for watching, I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. So I made this few days ago. I put it in the container because it's leaking. You don't want to put your chopstick directly into a bag. However, I just have only three pieces left, so I'm going to finish this up. We enjoyed this for a few days. Mmm. Nice and sweet, crunchy, and slightly sour. And it's not salty at all. So on the next day, it was slightly pink, but now it's whole pink. I mean, like, it's really beautiful now. If you don't have red daikon, as I told you, you can use white one. I hope you like this idea. Thumbs up. Please subscribe to my channel and make sure to hit the bell icon so that you won't miss any of my new videos. Bye.